Do you know what can? What's the worst that can happen? Oh, I, the worst. I'm sure you know. You know what I'm going to say. <laughs> yeah. but the worst that can happen is patients are ultimately at the end of these yeah. systems, and this yeah. is becoming increasingly more important. Digital health solutions software is becoming integral to the way we deliver healthcare. Yeah, it's everywhere. Isn't exactly. It? Yeah. And there's been many cases in the press, in the BBC, of issues with health IT systems that have led to patient harm. Mm. And there was a report last year published in the BBC that right. three potentially avoidable deaths occurred as a result wow. of health IT systems and failures. Uh, there are other reports of, say, for example, hundreds of thousands of letters not being sent based on health IT software issues. Uh, and this results in patient harm not knowing about their appointments or their diagnoses or, yeah. or, or whatnot. So, yes, uh, it's very important that this work is done. And often you can't eliminate risk, but just going through a standard process where you can flag potential risks, add some controls to implement them, monitor, all of these things can ultimately reduce the risk of harm yeah. coming to patients. And there, there is a balance because you, we do need these tools. They need mm -hmm. to be deployed, but there is a way to do it safely and efficiently. Yeah.